Time now 716 on this Sunday morning. We have to check in with meteorologist Carl Lamb to talk about the forecast that we have because Carl, we're breaking those 90 degree temperatures luckily, but you're saying there's rain in the forecast. Yes, there sure is, and uh, it's really going to be noticeably different once we get into the afternoon and evening because that rain will be coming down. But uh, you know, right now it is a very warm start out there. It's 80 in Pittsburgh, 79 in Beaver and 78 in Catanning and down in Connellsville, 79, 79 in Greensburg too. So even to start the day, we're at 716 and it's already this warm. Thankfully, though, uh, we have kind of a cap on how warm it gets today. Scattered severe weather possible in our region. It really extends all the way up to uh, even parts of Maine, so it's a big stretch of potentially severe weather, but everyone shaded in yellow. You could be in line for a few severe storms today, so that's something we want you to be just weather aware about. So uh, definitely this line of storms has our attention that's making its way toward Cleveland right now, so it will eventually push into our region. That's the big impact, but notice all this cloud cover in place. We didn't have this yesterday. This is essentially kind of like a blanket and it's not going to allow as much sunshine through, which kind of puts a cap on how warm things will be today. So we were at 80 degrees at the airport. It doesn't get much warmer than the mid 80s today, so we don't get into the 90s. That is for sure, and the rain will also help to cool things down, but we just have to time this out for you because uh, we're going to walk through this very meticulously by about 10 to 11 o'clock. We're watching uh, the rain showers moving in, and they will be steady at times. A few downpours can't be ruled out. When you see the oranges and yellows, that could mean some thunder and lightning embedded within that as well. By about noon to one o'clock, we're expecting some of those rain showers to be on the steadier side. We take you to about two o'clock. This is not the main attraction. What is going to develop by the time we get to about four or five o'clock is this next line of rain that has the potential to bring the rain thunder, lightning, hail, and those really gusty winds, potentially damaging winds here. We take you to about six o'clock. Notice how this continues to trek further south. So right into downtown Pittsburgh, into areas like Indiana and down towards areas and uh, I mean, even the southern portion of our viewing area will start to get in on this later, but we take you to seven o'clock working its way further down Uniontown. You'll get this a little later tonight, but it will kind of push on through. And just giving you an idea that once that's done by about 10 to 11 o'clock, it will start to kind of clear out and the humidity will be dropping as well. That is the real key here because then Monday is just fantastic. It feels much different and we will have brilliant sunshine. And the key here is that temperatures will stay cool and even some areas maxing out tomorrow in the low 70s or, or in the upper 70s to low 80s. So uh, let's review today 86 for your high tonight. Uh, I mean, it, we're getting closer to more comfortable sleeping weather conditions in the evening, but uh, Monday's the real prize here. 82 degrees again. That's out at the airport. I would say areas if you head up towards a uh, clarion, you probably just max out about 79 degrees on Monday. Then for Tuesday, the heat and humidity return. It's just not going to be a prolonged stretch because Wednesday we have temperatures in the upper 80s, rain and thunderstorms as well. Once that rolls through, the cold front will take care of some of the heat and humidity for Thursday, and then we warm back up as we head into Friday and Saturday. So a little bit of a roller coaster ride this week, Megan.